I had Charlie in the middle of lockdown six weeks early. I hadn't felt any movements for nearly 24 hours. Within 20 minutes of being at the hospital, I was having a C-section. I had to go home without him. I think I put a lot of pressure on myself to be with him. It was hard, I could barely walk to the end of the road to get to the bus stop. Having your baby in the same building as you is hard, but it's nowhere near as hard as walking away from the building without your baby. So, yeah. Yeah. I got in touch with Jasmine. She said, oh, actually, I've had the baby. <laughs> and I was like, oh my goodness. It became a little bit personal because I had my own son, 34 weeks pregnant. So she took me to the hospital and it really, it just made such a difference. And it was so nice when she got back in the car and she told me how he was doing and she was able to have that two hours with him, you know, not worrying, oh, I've got to get a bus in a minute. They say that mother and baby's bond happens within the first few days. Having someone come and help me to create that bond and make me feel like I am his mum meant a lot. Meant a lot. <laughs> It's all about making a difference to that patient's life. Maybe you think to yourself it's a little thing, but actually to her it was probably a big thing. It was so nice to be able to bring him home. It feels amazing to have a proper little family. It feels more complete.